don't expect what country can do for you, but think what you can do for the country. All you have to do is work together. You have to uh, follow the principles of GNH and you have to be self-aware. Me as a young people in this country is to be able to judge things by myself and to be able to be mindful of whatever we are doing. Just not like discriminating people, like discriminating their uh, older, old people, like uh, the grandfather, grandmother. Try to be good I and mean, we don't indulge in bad activities and then keep our dignity. Be positive to themselves, uh, respect elders, follow the path of GNH. Do good. Be a good human being, actually. Basic thing we can do is study hard and help people. Then maybe get a job. I feel that being a Buddhist and being a youth, we have to preserve our tradition and culture. So if they do good things and if they follow good rules and constitutions of our Bhutan, they would help to build a good government in future. Young people are the leaders of tomorrow, so I think they've got a lot of work to do. <laughs> Uh, yeah, some and some maybe not because they um, because they do they don't care about what's happening around. All they care about is themselves. They do drugs and etc. So I don't think, but some they care. That's why we can see a lot of changes happening because of the youth. As of now, I don't think because like get, uh, youth are getting more into gang fights, gang formation, stabbing. Because of these uh, televisions, so our youth, they have been now uh, mostly influenced to the Western cultures like drugs, robbery, stealing, burglar. And but I think uh, as they uh, grow up and face the real world, I think they'll become better and I think, I think Buddhist youths are good. <laughs> well, we don't see many uh, stuff happening, you know. It's mainly brought about by people who are letting the young people do the activities but we don't initiate I think. The capabilities and then the creativity is still sleeping in, inside there but they have to I mean it should they should wake up but they need some supporters who, to wake up these capabilities and all. There are certain extraordinary people who are doing and contributing to the society but there aren't enough. If I talk about the rural communities then you know young people are really more far active than I mean the urban community. People there, I mean the young people there, they go to school, you know, they really have to work, I mean, you know, they do all this exercise, they are more he way healthier, they don't play much, I mean, you know, football and basketball, things like that, but they are much healthier. They also help their parents, their family, and they also work in the field, you know, on the, on the weekends. They also look looks after the cattle almost every day. And, and I mean, I mean, they're they are always actively being involved in their community works. Uh, this Olympic, this year's Olympic in London, there is one girl, I think her name is Sheriff something, uh, she participated in archery, uh, which which will uh, allow uh, it, it will build inspiration in students to participate in Olympic and it will change uh, change the state of uh, countries and uh, countries and it will uh, help our students to build up hopes, hopes and if we build up hopes and go to other countries, it will represent our country and help in development of our countries. There's a lot of opportunities, but the only thing is you have to really work hard and then have an ultimate goal and then see whether we can reach to the goal or not. No, most of the youth they cannot reach out to these opportunities because it doesn't match their interest or um, it doesn't match what they want to have. So I feel that there should be more opportunities with regard to their interests so that they can open up their heart to it. Uh, I think first it's because we don't have enough exposure. Uh, we don't, and also because uh, maybe funds. There are lots of opportunities actually. It's just in our hands to grab those opportunities. The governments are, they are like, they are going to, they are um, having lots of competitions where children can share the ideas and they are, um, people are mostly attracted by the prizes so they are giving lots of attractive prizes and things and competitions to share the ideas and views. TFC, Design for Change, students are, give, are given uh, 
are given the opportunity to, to express their own opinion. If they express their own opinion, the government will know the problems of our country. So it will uh, do towards uh, do towards solving that problem. There are plenty of opportunities for youth, youth like us. Uh, firstly, there are good Golden Youth Award from which children get to go uh, to study in abroad. Uh, we have youth festival, youth festivals when, where we go and meet with other people, uh, I mean other students, and learn many things and new ideas. And also we have the games and sports which is very famous in our country, uh, through which uh, children get uh, to study in abroad as well as get scholarship in private schools.